Hey, yeah, Blizzard, good evening, everybody. This is uh, Joe Morgan. This is going to be a quick video right after the game. You can still hear the announcing in the background as a Royal will come back and win 5-2 to two tonight. Led by goal by Frank Kachara, assisted by Cressy and Grant, Trevor Gooch, assisted by Morrison and Cockrell. Millman, a one-time blast by Brandon Cooper. And then Morrison, assisted by Bosco. And then Pritchard, assisted by Ebbing. And then the Thunder also had a brilliant goal by Harper and a nice goal by a wrist shot by Thompson as well. And they had traffic in front of the net. The Royals got the momentum early in this one to then give some back to the Thunder as they were able to make it 3-2 to two to then pull back in front on a fortunate bounce of their own that went to Brad Morrison for the goal in front. Then they were able to get a nice pass by Tomas Ebbing. Um, seconds later, the one goal was at 17-11, 17-58 for the Pritchard goal. To then make it 5-2, to two, the ending score, as Harper's goal was short-handed. So the one thing coming out of this game on the negative, I'd say the Royals have to shorten up his defense on the penalty kill, or on the power play, excuse me, not the penalty kill. And then on the penalty kill, uh, Brandon Lowe had another good breakaway chance again. So overall tonight, saw a game played by the Royals, got the momentum going early on the 3-0 lead. Gave back some momentum, making it 3-2 as Harper Thompson got great goals for Adirondack. And then they battle back as Morrison gets a fortunate bounce for his 15th. And then Pritchard was able to get his 15th of the season in order to give the Royals the 5-2 lead, which is then what the ending score became because that goal at the end did not end up counting. That went in after the clock expired. Pat Nagel and also Cassell both had very good games. Cassell was able to make some key saves in this game. Um, in order to keep Adirondack in it and give them a chance to the end of the game to have it be a three goalie. So I would say the um, two goalies definitely stepped up big in this game. But the star of the game, the first star is what they said here. It's Brad Morrison, he had a goal and an assist. Uh, Dechara then would have to be a star of the game as well. And then I would say also just by how much he was flying around the ice and really looked good out there, I would have to say somebody that gets undervalued at times, but looked really good out there with a plus two tonight, had two assists as Jared Brandt. Um, I would have to give him the other star of this game. So I would say Morrison, Dechara, and Brandt with obviously Pat Nagel having a huge game again. So this has been the latest edition of the Royal Take as the Royals were able to win 5-2 to two to answer back after the tough loss yesterday that they really outplayed the Thunder and outpossessed them, but were able to get the loss. Unfortunately, they come back tonight and have a good game go 3-0, let them battle back to make it 3-2 then. Morrison scores and Pritchard scores seconds later, which put it away, and that was the ending score. Five right. to Peace out, everybody. Stay safe. Hope you enjoyed the game and enjoyed the latest edition of the Royal Take. Please be stuck down below. Please keep us growing to 215 by the end of March. Have a great day. Pleasant day, everybody. Peace out.